Hey, everyone. Welcome back to our blogger template creation from scratch series. In our previous episodes, we covered the basics tags but in today, we're going to dig deeper into the world of blogger tags, focusing on those that are crucial for customizing your template. So, let's dive in. The BF tag in Blogger allows you to show or hide content based on specific conditions. This can be incredibly useful for creating dynamic and personalized experiences for your readers. Here's an example of how you can use the BF tag in your Blogger template. In this code snippet, we're checking if the blog is set to private and displaying a personalized message accordingly. The BLOOP tag in Blogger enables you to iterate over a set of data, such as blog posts or comments, and display them dynamically on your blog. Let's take a look at how you can leverage the BLOOP tag in your Blogger template. Let's break it down in simple terms. Values, this tells the loop what to repeat over and over, like a list of things. VAR, it's like a nickname for each thing in the list, so you can talk about them one by one. In Blogger, the B section tag is used to define areas within a layout theme, such as a sidebar or footer. Each section has specific attributes like ID, class, max widgets, shawaddlement. The id is a unique name, the class is optional for common names like navbar or footer. Max widget sets the maximum number of widgets allowed. Shawaddlement determines if the add a page element link is shown. On the other hand, the B widget tag represents individual widgets within a section. Each widget has attributes like ID, type, locked, title, page type. For example, here in the code that call the blog widget, that return all post titles. The B default markups tag is used to define default markup settings that can be referenced throughout the template. Within B default markups, you can specify B default markup elements with a type attribute for example, common, and include B includable elements inside them. These B includable elements store code or data that can be reused in various parts of the template. By defining these inclusions within B default markups, you create a centralized repository of reusable content that can be easily inserted using B include tags. To utilize these inclusions, you can reference them using bInclude tags like bInclude name equals test content. This functionality was introduced in the version 3 template engine but is now compatible with older v2 templates as well. And there you have it. We've covered a variety of essential blogger tags that will take your template customization to the next level. Thanks for joining me today, and I'll see you in the next episode. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more tips and tutorial.